longer the nails grow, even when the corpse is cold. I've seen it myself. That's not true. You think what? There's a bit of life left in someone long dead. No, it's the fumes in the body. Odors grow after a killing, so they have to escape by any means they can. Eivor, my muscle-banded friend! There's a nest of Bigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. The fewer lies in the bush, the less itchy the pussycat. That's how I see it. Hmm. How did you come to join Zoma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa... ...smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust... She's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love... ...everything about her. You seem to bring life and spirit to this clan. Does Soma feel the same? If I knew what was going on in another person's head... ...I'd find life dreadful and dull. But Soma seems to enjoy my company. In what way? Her own way. Just not in the way I'd like. Painful truths are easy to bear when you can laugh, you see. Delight in the face of suffering is an act of rebellion. I don't think she'd betray Soma. What do you think of Soma's other warriors? Galen and Leaf? Oh, Leaf's got that raw animal pull. Every time I see him, I want him to climb me like a tree and nest in my armpits. He brays about being honorable, but I've never met a man of honor who starts a fire just to be praised for putting it out. And Galen. He broods like it's an art form. He's got this... Uh, ...self-importance that is just so charming. It's interesting that she said Leaf would start a fire just to put it out himself. So he would probably start the... ...like become a traitor... ...Soma... ...just to be able to be a hero. To become more of the, the second in command like he wants to be. We could talk all day, but these Saxons may fly from their nest. You and I should take a closer look. My men will hang back and come running if things go sideways. Oh, just leave me to do it all. Great. It's because I work in the public, they'd rather pay me not to start a mini painting. Yeah, that makes you sense. Bring a thrill. Happy I can see it up close. Don't get too close. I might black your eye or bruise your head. <laughs> You'd lose your elbow before the bruises showed. Best not to draw attention here. I hate the quick ones. Jesus That's alright, we'll just knife everybody. You've made more noise than Ragnarok's end, and these Saxons still don't see you. Not everyone is so fox eared as you. More stupidity. Yeah, that's why I like Ghost of Tsushima a lot. It has like the elements of Assassin's Creed I like. And uh... It's set in Japan. I really need to get back in and finish that. Like... Mostly through the second act out of the third- out of the three. You're light on your feet and quick through the grass. Sound carries through the smoke. I learned jump. Sneaking in and out of bedroom windows. I have to sit here. Let's 
funny how they glitch out and run so fucking fast. Yeah, I never played any of the old ones, but I like the uh, the new style a lot. And a lot of people seem to hate like the RPG elements that they add into it, but I really enjoyed um, Assassin's Creed Origins because it took place in like ancient Egypt. thing about Odyssey, which was like the Roman, was that it was just so big. Oh shit, he stopped walking. Yeah, I did the exact same thing. So like an odyssey where, you know, I was trying to find literally everything, it would take so long. And then you just look at the map and it's overwhelming. This one still has a lot of the, uh, like, mysteries and, they call them mysteries, wealth and artifacts. Uh, this game definitely has a lot. But so far, most of them haven't been as, like, um, tedious so far. It could very easily get be a little bit more than I want to deal with. But the 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 difference is, and I think this helps it, is that in Odyssey and um, well, Origins wasn't too bad, but. Odyssey in particular, they had, um, shit, guys, come on. They had so much gear. Where this one, the gear is pretty limited. That's all. Like every time in Odyssey you would kill somebody, you'd get like purple gear, green gear, like different tier items and your inventory was like full of them and you'd be constantly like switching out items upgrading them where this one there's very minimal gear comparatively like you know in 25 hours that i've been playing i've only gotten and really it's only been like two cloaks this one came it was like um some twitch prime bonus and so like I'm, I'm only working with like very limited items weapons are a little bit different but it's not like you get 20 bone biters and they all have randomized stats you know you find the one and that's that's the one that you have and the stats are always the same and then you just stick with it if you like it and upgrade it and that'll last you like the whole game if you wanted to that's all of them ah the solitude of after slaughter shame about the smell though men shitting themselves you fought very well vienna is that how you flirt eivor is that how i what easy now drenger 
I'll see you back in Grand Bridge. Like I'm still using the um the starting armor set. <laughs> 